This weekend, you can see the female version of The Odd Couple at McMurray University. Here to tell us more is David Ainsworth, Haley Isbell, and Holly Binti. Thank you, all three of you, for joining us today. So, David, you're directing this show. Yes. Tell us about the story of The Odd Couple. Well, in the mid 1980s, Neil Simon decided to increase his cash flow by adapting one of his biggest successes. And he knew that the original Odd Couple, the mismatch of the neat and sloppy guy who become roommates. He knew that was one of his biggest money makers royalty wise, but he also suspected that he wasn't making as much money as he could off the royalties in amateur venues because the original Odd Couple has six men and two women in the mm -hmm. cast and most amateur venues have more women than men. So he rewrote it telling exactly the same story but changing all the details so that Felix and Oscar become Florence and Olive the four poker playing buddies become four trivial pursuit playing mm -hmm. gal pals <laughs> and the british pigeon sisters from upstairs become the spanish costa suela brothers otherwise it's the same story all right and so haley what are, what is your role in this um i play olive uh, she's kind of a, a sloppy just really carefree carefree just doesn't really give a care in the world mm -hmm. so yeah so kind of like me i like it yeah. all right <laughs> and holly what are you what are you i am florence she's super compulsive and very neat and in your face about how neat she is and um like likes to spend money probably her ex-husband's money um okay yeah. <laughs> and so what what are what about these roles do you guys like I like that I get to yell and nobody tells me that it's wrong because I, I have to it. yell for the character. That's fun. <laughs> All right. So, Hadley, what do you like about your role? Um, she doesn't. She's very carefree and super down to earth and just doesn't care and super sloppy. And I'm not. So it's a lot of fun just to kind of lay back and not do much and just kind of be. So it's a lot of fun. All <laughs> right. And so, David, what made you want to do this female version of the show? Well, the McMurray Centennial theme this year is McMurray Creates. And we decided to structure the entire fall season around unique creations that have become American cultural icons mm -hmm. in some way. And of course, the homecoming musical, You're a Good Man, Charlie Brown, centered around the iconic Peanuts cartoon strip. And the odd couple, what, be they male or female, have become such American icons as characters that we figured that fit right in. So much so that some critics have called the odd couple, the great American comedy because of those two iconic mm -hmm. characters. And it's the same sort of icon whether they're male or female personages. All right. Mm -hmm. And so how many people are in this show for you? Eight. Eight? Mm -hmm. All female? No. Uh, six women, two men. Okay. Six women and two men. All right. When can we see this show? Uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. All right. right? Uh, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday evening performances, Sunday matinee. All right, and girls, tell us really quickly what your majors are. Uh, I'm actually a theater major. Theater major, yes. okay. I'm a double major in psychology and religion. Okay, so kind of stepping outside <laughs> yes. your, your uh, degree there. All right, well, we appreciate you coming on the show. Thank you. If you want to come out and see it, it will be at McMurray University in the Ryan Little Theater, November 21st through the 23rd at 7.30 p.m., and there will be a matinee November 24th at 2 p.m. Tickets are just $10. To get yours, you can call 793-3889 or go to mcm.edu slash theater.